In Uganda, there are few things as readily available as bananas. 35-year-old entrepreneur Sharon Ninsima is turning their stocks into paper bags to solve a huge environmental concern in the country. I wanted to fight against polythene bags. You know polythene bags, they take long to rot. Uh, my, my paper bags, they can not even take a week to rot. Sharon's banana fiber paper is used to make bags that are an environmentally friendly alternative to non-biodegradable plastics. At her workshop in the capital, Kampala, Sharon feeds banana stalks into a machine that extracts the fiber, which is boiled and mixed with waste paper, then converted into pulp and finally smoothed out into sheets of paper. You fold a paper bag using hands. We don't have a machine that makes paper bags. So I need a paper bag for a paper bag forming machine. I need it. When I can get those machines, I can I can have an opportunity to expand my business. I can now start exporting these bags and these papers. The bags cost about 50 US cents each. Local companies like Bella Wines, a drinks company in Kampala, are using Sharon's bags as part of their marketing and branding strategy. Okavera has never been my, my choice of packaging because I saw in, in Rwanda they were not using it and paper bags were more, more durable than these Caveras. The environment was good. You can imagine how these Sharon's bags there's no way someone can use it and throw it on the roadside. Plastic bags, locally known as caveras, pile up on roadsides and unused land. They spread disease, they hurt animals, and often end up in wetlands surrounding Lake Victoria, where it pollutes water supplies. But they are still popular around the country, despite a ban issued nine years ago, because they're favored by retailers who like the fact that they are cheap. Because we have branding. We, we have banana plants everywhere. So these are the, the extraction of, of the fiber from the banana plantain and, 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 and improving the paper material, the simple right paper material, uh, to something more stronger is something that we desire. And, and we have seen corporate companies in their corporate social responsibility uh, taking upon these initiatives. Uh, most of these are, are desiring to have uh, enough market for their branded products to be put in these eco-friendly uh, alternatives to the plastic polythene bag. Sharon, who left a job as an office messenger four years ago, makes about 50 bags a day. She says with more investment, she can expand her business and start exporting to the rest of the country and even East Africa. Uche Okoronkwo, CCTV.